your mind. All but right. Hard to believe that was two years ago. I, yeah, it was two years ago. And we're waiting for our next match, ADHD and money, money, money. Mm -hmm. Money, money, money. That's three times in case you wanted to know how much money is on this, on this guy's pockets right now. Going up against one of the absolute legends of Super Smash Brothers Brawl. Well, the greatest Diddy Kong to ever do it in that game, ADHD from New Jersey, out here yeah. with the same patented Diddy he had before, with the same color. Yeah, you know it. And, and he's just side beam, monkey flipping towards Zelda right now. And Nintunas, do you notice something a little different about the stage? Uh, what, what is it? What's so different about the what, stage what? right now? Yo, that platform oh, um, is moving. Yeah, it's kind of moving and grooving, isn't it? Oh my god, dude, I'm gonna be real with you for a second. I actually don't think I would have like even taken a second notice at that. If it, like, I probably would have taken me like halfway through the match, like with how often you and I commentate, for me to even realize that. Oh my god, we're yeah. really old school, baby. Oh, look yeah, at it I'm, go! I'm, I'm loving this, but ADHD is now down to stock. Mm-hmm. That he is. I mean, this this ain't Brawl Zelda, as far as everything considered, you know? Like, yeah, that's, no, this, this, this ain't Zelda's, no bottom two character. This Zelda's kind of playable right now. Uh-huh. Definitely kind of playable. Diddy, of course, has the tools to contest with Zelda, of course. Dash Attack, not going to do it against ADHD yet, who is definitely suffering so far pretty hard throughout this game. Down 3-1 yeah. in only a minute 20 seconds. Player 4, what's going on? Uh, ADHD is just holding forward and just getting hit by a lot of fans, Phantom right now. Just not respecting it enough, it seems. I thought we were going to see, see a grab, but this is just not looking good. Yeah. Uh, does he think it is Brawl Zelda? Yeah, does he think he, he can just hold forward? He, he saw Brawl, and he's like, yo, it has to be Brawl Zelda. Yo, three. <laughs> no, definitely not the case. Yeah, no, it definitely isn't. Fourth throw? Okay, just keep him off. Yeah, th that game was not looking good. Mm-mm. Alright, no. we're probably going to see a character switch from ADHD, but he is now limited to the Brawl roster. Mm. I don't know of why it's other characters in Ultimate, specifically, is that up smash definitely going to whiff on block right there. So clutch, money, 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 to be able to get that shield <laughs> real quick, sounded yeah. like Mr. Krabs. <laughs> money, 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 money. I know yeah. ADHD did try to play Peach. I mm -hmm. did hear about that. Oh, that's true. So I don't know if we're going to see, but Peach Online isn't the greatest of characters. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if we're going to see the switch. Yeah, we'll Peach find does, out momentarily. Peach does have an okay matchup against, oh my god, that Phantom right there. The trap was beautiful, man. Throwing out the up air to stop, create a no-fly zone for no monkey flips on the part of ADHD. Instead, waiting to monkey flip below and putting out that displaced Phantom Knight. Bread and butter Zelda, ladies and gentlemen. The character can, in fact, be in two places at once. She has that white knight for her wherever she goes, ready mm -hmm. to defend her and throw out at any and all wills, man. I mean, she didn't have that, you know, I like to call it the viability move, because without it, yeah. Zelda would be trash. But... She, yeah, she did not have... She didn't have that blow before in Brawl. And even in Smash 4, she didn't even have him, I think. No, she a, did. She, she did, did, but she oh. couldn't move. Remember, she couldn't cancel it. Oh, I, I, I completely forgot about that. Yeah. Zelda is just a blur. <laughs> <laughs> she's been a blur throughout the history of Smash. She's always been trash, <laughs> and except for you know, except for Ultimate, where she's yeah. finally gotten her chance to shine. You know, got Ultimate's that. Uh, the, Ultimate's the game where like everybody got the glow up. So I can agree if, with that. If you were doing so hot in your previous Smash game, Ultimate's the game where like yo. Sakurai paid attention to you. For the most part, yeah. I can't think of very many characters, if any, that were nerfed from Smash 4 over to Ultimate. I mean, there are some. There Don't were, get me the, wrong. The previous top tiers. Yeah, yeah, the previous top tiers, of course, with the exception of that. I mean, there's so many characters in the game that I, like, I can't, like, people tell me, like, all right, what does this matchup go? Like, how, how many characters beat this character? Come on, David, your opinions are trash. And I'm like, I literally have to remember every character in the game. I need to look at the list sometimes before that. All right, Brawl, so, however, a little smaller of a list. Yeah, Easier we're seeing, yeah, we're seeing, FD is our kind of pick here. The little, oh, okay. Looks like we're getting, yeah, a few SDs. It's supposed mm -hmm. to probably be a battlefield, not FD battlefield here. And it doesn't look like we have a character switch, so we're gonna see the same characters here on probably Battlefield, it looks like. Okay. 
Looking good, looking good right here. Looking like we're sticking to a lot of the uh, a lot of the more basic. Uh, what am I trying to say here? A lot of the more uh, standard legal stages that we've had in just the more recent previous Smash games as well. Yeah. Though I did definitely forget about the about the platform. Thank you for pointing that out. I yeah, would have missed it. Oh, that that one. That's kind of hard to miss. I, I have more faith in you, so. Okay. On that one. No, I, I don't know, man. It's like it would have been like a weird like. It would have been a weird, like, psychology thing, if I'm being honest, because yeah. at the same time, I'm used to casting and playing sets on that stage from Smash 4 with a moving platform for, like, about three years at that point. Yeah. It's only been about two that I've casted with it being stationary, mm -hmm. so it would have been, like, a subconscious thing of me not knowing where I am at any given time. Probably not some good early warning signs for me on my part. Maybe I should yeah. go yeah, talk to somebody about that. Go but talk to game two. local neurologist for yeah, this I one. Probably that might be a good idea. Game two, though, player four. Let's do it. Yeah, yeah we are. And this is ADHD's counter pick. We did lose game one. And I personally don't agree with this stage because I think Knight allows Zelda to just stay under that platform, as you see right there. Oh, like, it just allows Zelda to stay under the platform and just do her shenanigans. Mm hmm. I definitely can agree with that to that extent. I mean, for me personally, I think it might definitely depend on the character and how specifically mobile they are and how they're going to really make use of this platform versus Phantom Knight. Because you could just go with the standard bread and butter and be like, oh, the knight is placed there. I want platforms to get above that. But the Zelda player knows that. So they're definitely going to be thinking about that positioning relative to it and how they can use the platform to their advantage, like you said, getting under it before. And then on top of that, if Zelda ever gets the banana like she has right now, that's just one extra tool for her to create some no-fly zones player for. So, yeah. yeah. And you, you kind of want to use banana to combo off of. ADHD was known for his banana specialties in Ultimate. And not in Ultimate and in Smash 4. Mm -hmm. And in Brawl. I'm going through all the Smash games right there. <laughs> Yeah, to be honest, I'm surprised he hasn't... To, to be honest, I'm really surprised he isn't just mashing down B right now since Money 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 has the banana to just try to spawn a second one. Yeah. A, I mean, this is a brawl event. I mean, he's just like, why? where's my second nanner? Come on. He just uh, wants it. He just wants it yeah. so bad. Maybe if he, maybe he could just will it into existence, you know, manifest it like some of those self-help books say. Yeah. All right. What are we going to see? Throwing out some buttons is ADHD right now. Trying to read some rolls on the part of money, money, money or something. Hoping that he could just catch him performing some bad option out of advantage. Going for the grab right there. I thought that for sure that would be a forward smash, but he will elect to still get good stage positioning against Zelda instead. So not much you can do about her on the way back. That hitbox on that uppie is quite large. Yeah, no, it definitely is. Oh, that down smash right there. Not See, he so... tripped. <laughs> yeah. He did trip. <laughs> yeah, I think he made Zelda drop the banana right there. Yeah. Alpha down smash. It actually hit him on the way down. That's pretty funny. Yeah, it, it, I thought it was a callback for Brawl. <laughs> that, oh, oh my <laughs> god, you're right. <laughs> was there a 25% chance of that trip happening? I don't know. Mm. Or yeah, whatever the percentage so. was. I don't know. Yeah, it's a lot lower than 25. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I remember hearing 25 when I was younger or something, but I didn't play Brawl competitively. I was a very young lad. Yeah. Oh, there. You actually have more chances of tripping. You have only a chance of tripping if you dash. Or running. You don't trip if you, if you were walking. Mm-hmm. And who wants to dash in Smash Brothers, am I right? No. No one would ever do <laughs> such a bad option. Oh! That, that's such a standard Diddy play right there by ADHD. The walk back F Smash. And you, we're seeing a lot more control. So... The color pick is working out for him. Yeah seen this matchup more recently in the terms of Rivers versus, I believe, 17, or it might have been Inu, I don't remember. They're two top Wi-Fi Zeldas who compete in DNA quite frequently, and one thing I remember seeing Rivers do quite a bit in that matchup is sort of playing more of like a mid-range game against Zelda, you know? You yeah, get in too close against... Oh, please, continue. Yeah, no, I'm here just here to agree with you, because Zelda's thing is, like, her, she, she's able to, like, hit you up close with her decent buttons, and her okay on shell option which is only lb mm -hmm. and but if she plays like her thing from a distance if you could play at the mid range from against her that's where she has to struggle because her burst options aren't that great for sure man for sure not to, not even to mention naryu's love as the combo breaker as well that intangibility starts on frame five before the move even comes out so if you ever get mad as that back throw takes the stock you ever get mad swinging at zelda like no i hit her before the naryu's love came out well you did 
but the intangibility came out first since that's a frame five option. So up close, it can be one thing, but then long range player four, what are you gonna do? If you're playing the long range, it gives Zelda all the time in the world to get her stage positioning back with her stage positioning button in Phantom Knight. That's why yeah. the mid range with Diddy is so important. Yeah, it definitely is. And now ADHD is at 83% on his last stock. He's just been falling into those phantoms. Oh boy. And now both players are just swinging. Not good. Not a good place to be. Oh, he commits! Money, 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 commits! Oh. He commits again! But why it drops it twice? Yeah. Oh it's no. Not it's not looking good. Oh, Mike, he's right. got banana in hand though. Just needs one throw confirmed, player four. This is all he needs. But yeah, the knight oh, the... gonna come in clutch. That was a good setup right there. Oh, yeah, this is just dash back. Oh, we got air dodging That's... in. Oh, player four, this is absolutely yeah, nerve wracking. This is a full Italian, Italian meal. Full Italian meal mm -hmm. right now. Ready spaghetti. Freddy spaghetti. Mm -hmm. Parks and Rec. Oh, by the this narrow is... last hit. Of the Naryu's love. Smash attack. No, he Nothing. knew he didn't have enough time to commit. No. He's still living here. Alright, throwing out some peanuts at both of them. See how he likes it. Knight's out again. He's gonna just gonna hold shield this time, afraid of it, but he does hit him with oh. a banana, which made the Phantom Knight go away. Yeah, and that's it. Wow. Shield poking <laughs> from the back of the shield. My goodness. Wowzers. That was just rough, man. It's like he was trying to play a lot more patient, toward, or Wyatt was trying to play so much more patient towards the end of that. Like right here, he could have walked in to hit, but he didn't realize that the knight was actually going to go away because he hit him with the banana yeah. off of the banana toss in the first place. He was still holding shield as if that thing was going to come and clutch like my woman. But no, he, he didn't like right here. And then no, oh. no, he dropped shield right there. Wow. You're yeah, right. He drops. Yeah, that's that. a shield drop. That's a shield drop. So, which means he probably tried jumping. Mm hmm. Yeah. You could shield drop in a uh, brawl, right? You could shield drop through the platforms, or. Yeah. I'm pretty sure you drop. can. Like, isn't Ultimate the. Yeah, Ultimate's the only one you Ult can't. I, I was about to Ultimate, say. Ultimate, and no, nah, you could do it in 64 also. Yes. 64 was mad easy because there was no spot dodging. You just hit down, yeah. and there you go. Beautiful. But there you go. I swear to That's God, it. like there were moments in that set, player four, where I, I, I'm telling you, ADHD might have had a little ADHD because he definitely thought he was fighting Brawl Zelda in that first game with the way he was holding in. He's he like, just, I can just mash. He just kept monkey flipping, and that's just not the way Ultimate works. You you can mash, but it's you got to be smart about your mashing. Mm -hmm. For sure, my friend.